you guys are like us, you guys are on a family vacation and you want to do a little bit of fishing while you're while you're out. We are right now in Maui and I decided that I wanted to do some fishing so I looked up a bunch of videos and I couldn't find really any good videos on YouTube about how to fish around the reef and around the rocks and stuff and how to catch just like the little reef fish that are that are hanging out around the beaches so I am gonna compile like a bunch of different videos and things that I've seen. I've talked to a bunch of locals and so uh, I'm gonna throw it into a video for you guys. So. Um, I decided that I wanted to bring my 7 foot Shakespeare uh, Agility, it's a medium action and I've got the Abu Garcia Black Max 30, 30 class, so it's a 3000 class reel. I've got it on 20 pound braid and we're using a 10, uh, 10 pound fluorocarbon leader. Uh, what I figured out works the best is that you just do like your standard bobber rig. So these, it's kind of like a bobber but they call it a resin ball and I just connect it to I just connect it to a swivel here and then I've got the, the bobber, the resin ball and then just depends on the depth you're fishing. You put about that much leader down so that you can get into the rocks but so that it doesn't get stuck. So you'll have to, you'll have to play with where you're at and how deep the rocks are so you can play with the leader and then just get the smallest. I, I'm using an octopus like a circle hook but you can do like a plain shank, straight shank, you can do whatever kind of hook but just make sure they're, they're smaller or bigger depending on the fish that you're targeting. We're using little chunks of squid, but you can also use uh, shrimp, you can use cut up little bait fish, you can use whatever chunk of meat you want. They're just gonna be big or small depending on the fish you guys are catching. So um, we also have uh, another setup, it's called whipping, and I'll show you that one right now. All right, so this rig is called whipping. Uh, we were talking to a guy at Gigi's Tackle Shop. You should definitely go check it out if you guys are in Maui. That guy, he knows what he's talking about. He is super friendly with the, the tourists and uh, he, he got us set up pretty good. So he was explaining about the rigs and like the type of line that we should be using. And so, so he was super helpful. Uh, he was explaining like the colors and he had everything that we needed. So basically the whipping, it's uh, like if you guys fish for, for bass or whatever back home, uh, we call it the Carolina rig. So it's just my main line and it's got the sliding. It's like, a, I've got, this is a one ounce, this is a half ounce, but they, you know, you can do bigger, smaller, depending on how deep or, or shallow the, the water is. You could do smaller if you're not fishing that far out or if it's shallow. You can do a bigger one if you need to get deeper and farther. Um, and then I've just got, I've got the swivel and then I've got my leader. And they say you should have a pretty long leader, like as long as you can get it about the length of your rod. So this is a seven foot rod. So you want it probably around seven to six and a half feet long. Again, it's the, the 10 pound fluorocarbon. I've got the curly tail grub. And notice how maybe like a lot of people think that you needed it on a jig head, but I don't have it. I don't have it on a jig head. Uh, the guy was explaining that it kind of messes up the action. So it's better if it's just on a plain hook. A plain hook, I do it on the same hooks that I have done the, the squid and the, the bait fish on. So um, that that's your whipping rig and so you'll You'll just yak it out into the surf and then you don't you don't do it as fast as you possibly can but you have to reel it faster so if you're fishing for for bass or trout or whatever spinners back home you're going to do it probably like one and a half to two times speed uh retrieval and then sometimes you can give it like a little bit of a bump and uh i'll get some gopro clips of that garrison caught a needlefish doing it this morning so we'll, we'll throw that footage in in the clips but but the, those are the two rigs that we'll do uh, and all the other videos that I found on YouTube like they only showed the rig or they only showed them catching fish with like crappy subtitles so uh, we're gonna hopefully get the explaining and showing the rigs and then we're gonna get catching fish on it too so stay tuned thanks for checking out the video oh I do have one hey This one swallowed it, so I'm gonna have to cut the hook, but that's a pretty decent sized one. I have something. I got one. Good something. Oh. He's wrapped up in the rocks right there. You got one too? Me and Garrison are both hooked up. Oh! 
Oh, dude, it's one of the big surge races. It's another super colorful one, but a bigger one. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll get a picture of... Can you get a picture of me and then I'll get a picture of you? Yep. Yeah, I mean, you can get your finger in there if you want. I'll hold them tight. Dude, that's cool. Got one. Oh, that's what's up. Eehaw! Oh, I have one. Huh, <laughs> it was snagged and then it wasn't snagged and then I had a fish. There we go. I got one. I'm all wrapped up. Screwed the pooch on this one big time. I'm all sorts of freaking wrapped up around my reel. Gare. Yeah, this is a freaking big one. It's a, uh, that's a surgeon or a sergeant major. <laughs> they're so chill. And then you throw them into the water and they're gone. I've got my bobber sitting right down in here. I'm kind of hanging back right here on the rocks because I don't want the fish to see me. Maybe that'll help me. Oh, I think I just got a bad. Oh. Yeah, got one. I'm on. One of these little sculpting things. I'm good at catching these ones, dude. I don't know what the deal is, but they're everywhere. There you go. Man, that that sounded like a hurt. I hate when that happens. I, that happens to me all the time. Oh, I got a needlefish. Yeah, I was like right below me. Oh my gosh, it's giant. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. What even? <laughs> can I borrow your pliers, Grandpa? They're right here, I can see them. There we go. That is so what cool. the heck? Sweet. 
That was sick. Dude.